Well, the first thing I would say is uh, the father of bride that I'm pleased and, and feel like I'm blessed to have a father as my daughter and also as Gerald being a son and son-in-law. And I am equally great to have a God-fearing man in my daughter's life who just is remarkable to be able to marry my daughter and also make her happy. And that makes us happy. So we're blessed to have Gerald into our family. Never give up. One thing I always know is let God be the lead. Right. And never give up. Just keep on focusing on God and He'll lead your path through any circumstances, anything. We've been married for 36 years, so we're blessed. So we want them to be married for much more. But yeah, 36 years will be great. We love y'all. We both. love you. Have a good time. <laughs> Well, I just want to say to my son, Gerald, I'm really proud of you. Um, I hope and pray that God will bless you. You continue to live a blessed and happy life with you and your wife. I want to say, first of all, I want to thank God for this wedding. I want to thank God for my son. I am so, so proud of him. Um, I thank God for Dominique. You know, you like a daughter to me now. I always wanted two girls and two boys, and I got my wish. I'm so, so happy for y'all that God will bless y'all for years to come. I say that you should stay strong with each other, keep God first, and only keep God in your business. If you feel like you need to go to someone else for help, go to a married couple. And also, I think marriage counseling is fine for couples to take. A lot of people don't think it's necessary, but according to what I've been learning from other marriage couples, it's good to go to the marriage seminars and read your Bible together, stay strong together, and you know, I believe you can make it work if you just listen to each other, always talk to each other, understand each other. If you don't understand each other, take the time or something, but, you know, stay strong with each other and never put no one else in your business. And I love you guys so much. I think he's he's doing well. I, I'm glad that he found somebody that he really loves so that he actually will stay, to, stay with and um, stay strong with. And you guys seem very happy, and I pray to continue and speak blessings for you. I am so excited that today has finally come. Um, today marks the first day of the rest of your lives, and you all uh, were created by God, and He brought the two of you together uh, for this perfect, beautiful union. I'm just so ecstatic and so happy and so joyous that today is the day, and I just wish you the best, um, and I love the both of you. Uh, <laughs> it just kind of happened, and once it happened, Everything happened, so um, it happened really quickly, um, but it is what it is. It's great, it's wonderful, and we're, we are all happy and happy for the both of them. I want to say congratulations. I am happy for you both. You guys couldn't be more perfect for each other because you're both goofy. Uh, Dominique, I know that you have your work cut out for you, but trust me, this is going to be a family affair and raising your uh, son slash husband, Gerald. Uh, Gerald, to you, man, I want to say it's been great getting to know you. It's been great working with you. And I look forward to uh, many nights spent you know, on double dates with our wives together. So, you know, you always have a friend in me. Both of you always have a friend in me. And uh, always look to call me when you need me, buddy. He knows what this means. This is an inside joke. <laughs>